Hi everybody, how are you doing? Here is uh, Alexander and today I'm testing uh, a vast Internet Security version 5 and um, here is the interface it looks very fancy for my taste I like it a lot and um, let's see what we have under the settings let's go to a real-time shield and to expert settings and if you go to uh, sensitivity uh, it's a normal and I will move this to high and uh, I will also enable scan for potentially unwanted programs and suspicious files that's very important and if you go to web shield and uh, the same thing sensitivity move to high and uh, unwanted, pro unwanted programs and this is a full security suite as you all know uh, it has a firewall, uh, real-time protection, anti-spyware, and anti-virus of course uh, behavior shield, it has uh, some kind of sandbox I don't know, I still don't know how it works because um, it doesn't work for me and the people uh, who I know because if I run uh, my browser inside of that uh, if you right click on your browser and run it inside the sandbox um, it doesn't sandbox uh, malware that you download so if anyone knows how this works please let me know send me a comment or private message and um, I will appreciate that you have a script shield I am shield, peer-to-peer -peer shield, mail shield, mail shield, and um, it's v it's a version 5.0.677. Uh, this is the latest version. And um, let's check for updates. Installer is a. Uh, let me see. Uh, 52.5 megabytes that's okay this is a paid version of course a 30-day trial uh, let's wait for this as you can see already up to date and uh, I, I have collected uh, 14 malicious URLs uh, they are all from the last few hours some of them are from um, maybe 12 hours but they are all, f all fairly new so um, I have uh, exploits, fake AVs, uh, one TDSS, Zeus Trojan backdoors and we will see how this uh, evast works and um, let's first check for the memory usage it has three processes one two three and uh, all in all from what I see here uh, it's using uh, four let's say five eight only eight megabytes uh, only eight megabytes of RAM that's incredible <laughs> if this is true okay and uh, let's open up uh, Internet Explorer where is it? over here and uh, let's start the test the first one is uh, exploit I have installed Java so um, this should work but uh, this one is dead let me open up Process Explorer to see what's going on during the test okay um, let's continue here is a here is a Trojan backdoor and uh, let's run this okay uh, Evest blocked it let me see if I'm recording yes as rootkit rootkit blocked okay so um, let's move on 
threat has been detected. Okay. And the next one is Trojan. Run this and uh, it's running in memory. Okay. No alert from uh, Elast. Here is another exploit. I cannot copy this. So let's try this way. No. Uh, here is a Zeus Trojan. And uh, this one goes through with no problems at all. At all. And here is one nasty rootkit, Trojan TDSS. And uh, it was blocked. Okay. That's nice. Here is another Trojan. Oh, I'm very tired. I worked today. It's Saturday, I know, but um, it's my turn to work on weekend. And let's see what we what we have in memory. Um, now I don't see anything that is um, strange. Okay. And uh, let's try this exploit. Probably dead, as usual. Okay, never mind. Here is a fake AV. I hate weekends. And uh, this one is running in memory. Okay, it opened common prompt window. And uh, oh my god, a lot of processes over here. And this is a very annoying rogue. I hate this rogue. This is a fake MSE. Um, I will try to kill this process. Kill process. Because it wouldn't let me to run. Um, it it closed my Internet Explorer and uh, it wouldn't let me to run it again. <coughs> so I had to kill that process. And here is a f one flash plugin, fake flash plugin, and uh, it crashed. Okay, um, here is uh, another fake AV. Cannot copy this. Oh boy. And uh, this Trojan was blocked. Here is a Trojan backdoor. Let's see. And uh, it's in the memory and is it disappeared okay and uh, another fake AV and uh, nothing from uh, Avast from Avast or Avast whatever <laughs> Probably this is another fake MSC, yes, of course. I will close this and uh, kill the process. I think it's this one. And uh, let's run the last two links. I think it was... Uh, I'm not sure which one. Maybe this. Forgive me if I'm wrong. I'm sure about this one. Or maybe this. <laughs> okay. And um, 
let's try to run maybe this or this one I'm not sure oh my god another fake MSC I will not uh, waste your time anymore um, now I'm gonna do a scan with uh, a vest and uh, I'll be back with results okay um, a vest quick scan is done and uh, no threat found okay uh, now let's clean up uh, temp files using a C cleaner and after that uh, I'm gonna use my scanning tools over here and um, I'm gonna show you the results uh, after the Malwarebytes completed scanning so let's first check for updates and uh, don't go away I'll be right back okay um, I had to kill um, seven malicious process from a uh, process explorer because uh, Malwarebytes scan was uh, freezed for three times and uh, I wasn't able to complete the scan and finally it completed but it found uh, 11 infected objects and uh, let's count it as 18 because I killed 7 memory m processes from here 7 malicious processes and uh, let's see what we have here spyware password trojan generic uh, registry value Trojan agent, malware trace, Trojan fake alert in Windows and uh, let's clean this all I will not reboot this machine and uh, now I will run a scan with Hitman Pro and um, I'll be right back alright um, Hitman Pro only found a proxy server that was added um, by malware and uh, I will repair this and finally uh, I'll be back with the uh, Norton Power Racer scan results okay and uh, Norton Power Racer found nothing and uh, that's it and now I will try to to restart this machine and to see if uh, there is uh, any uh, any malware left behind that wasn't detected by Malwarebytes and Hitman Pro and Auto Power Racer and uh, I'll be back in a few seconds alright guys uh, I restarted uh, this machine and uh, if you go to Process Explorer uh, memory seems to be clean right now and it looks like Malwarebytes um, cleaned everything probably but uh, I'm sorry to say that um, that a vest didn't do that well today and um, don't forget to subscribe comment and rate and uh, thanks for watching everybody bye bye